Here we got coming to the ring, Jack Rio. He's fighting out of Grants MMA in Toronto. He's 0-0. He's making his debut this evening. He's fighting at 165 pounds. He's a 24-year-old fighter. He's been training for six to seven years now. He's uh, primarily a boxer, and he plans to utilize his boxing skills, but he also plans to uh, take his opponent down to the mount with, uh, with takedowns and what have you. Up next, we got his opponent coming to the cage, Max Fournier. He's one and one. And one. He's uh, coming out of Pat No Martial Arts, so you better believe the fans, the local fans, will be cheering for him. He's uh, fighting at 165 pounds. He's 21 years old. He's been training for four years. He's primarily a striker, and uh, mixed martial arts allows him to push himself and to achieve his goals. That's what he was telling us earlier on. His game plan this evening is to do whatever, Lewis, to do whatever it takes to win. Here we go. Jack takes the center right away. Eats a big shot from Max. Jack appears to be boxing up Max Forney, but Max lands a huge shot. Both guys throwing hard leather here. Max with a nice leg kick. Jack answers with one of his own. Max Fournier throwing some big bombs and Jack Rio answering with some beautiful crisp counters of his own. Again, the overhand right for Max Fournier. He's throwing some heat. Jack is uh, very calm and focused. Very calm and a, and a good counter fighter and he goes for the takedown and he gets it and he's very inside nice. Max Fournier's guard. Very nice takedown by Jack Rio. Double leg takedown into the guard. Max Fournier is breathing very heavy here and he, he was throwing some big shots so. He appears to be going for a guillotine choke here. He seems to have it sunk in uh, significantly. Oh, Jack Rio gets out. Right out. He's trying to posture up and land some shots. Max Fournier locks him up once again. Max Fournier having a very active guard here. And Jack trying to pass. And it appears like he's gonna take side control. Jack Rio is just taking side control on Max Fournier. A great position for, uh, for Jack Rio. And again, he's very calm. He's not trying to hurry anything. He's trying to methodically set up something. That's it. Under 50 seconds in this bout. Jack Rio landing some shots to the face of Max Fournier. Max Fournier doing a good job of defending. Scar pull down by Jack Rio. I could be wrong, but I, it appears he's trying to isolate an arm there and work an arm bar or a Kimura. His but corner's yelling for that as well. Max Fournier being smart about it though. 10 seconds left in the round. Jack Rio postures up and he wants to land some shots. And he does. Good first round. Good round for the very calm and methodical Jack Rio. Max Fournier coming out with an aggressive style, throwing haymakers and Jack Ryle countering him with a takedown. Well, it. You know, the longer the fights go, the more and more cardio becomes uh, uh, an issue, right, for, for both, both fighters involved. Three minutes may not seem like a long time, but when you're in the cage, it has to be an eternity. 
Even even a even a minute, you know, 60 seconds in there, going 100 percent. Absolutely. You know. I'm interested to see how Max comes out in this round, whether he comes out swinging for the fences again or a little more controlled pace. And we're ready for the start of round two. And away we go, both guys in the center again. Jack walking down Max Fournier. Max answering with a nice kick. Big head kick by Max Fournier. Blocked well by Jack Rio though, but those still hurt your arms. Nice uh, combinations there, jab, cross, jab by Jack Rio. Both guys doing well against each other, counters. Rio's corners, uh, they're, they're asking him to keep moving, keep attacking, keep moving, keep circling, you know? Well, Jack Look. Rio has some good head movement. He's getting offline when Max is throwing that straight down the pipe. Max coming with that big overhand right again. And Fans Jack takes that. it. Jack thinking about the takedown, but Max Fournier steps offline. Great kick by Max Fournier. Landed a solid jab by Jack Rio. Max Fournier throwing some nice straight strikes and a spinning oh. back kick right to the solar plexus of Jack Rio. Very nice. Beautifully executed. Jack Rio popping for that. Eh? <laughs> Jack Rio shooting for the takedown again. Max Fournier sidestepping. Max Fournier appears to have calmed down a little bit and is fighting a little smarter while still working in those huge haymakers. Bringing that aggression, you know, with intermittent spurts of aggression. Absolutely. Max answers Jack's punch with a counter of his own. Big body shot by Max Fournier and a big shot to the chin. Max Fournier now walking down Jack Rio. We're under 40 seconds here. Round two. Max is working that body of Jack and it, it appears to have slowed him down a little bit. Big overhand right again by Max Fournier and now he's walking him against the cage. Nice takedown Jack, attempt by Jack Rio going for the Jack. takedown. Beautiful sprawl by Max. And they're back to their feet again. Less than 10 Big seconds. Big overhand right. Max trying to finish at the end of this round. Big flurry by Max Fournier. It's a slobber knocker. Jack Rio's nose is uh, clearly bleeding. He's bloodied up a bit, but though he ate some big shots. That's a fact. What a solid way to end the round, you know. What a solid way to end the second round. Putting a stamp on it, as they would That's say. <laughs> it's interesting how Max did come out and fought smarter in the second round and really worked the body of Jack Rio, and Jack appeared to be slowing down. This is Fournier's third fight. Uh, you know, he has, he has more experience uh, than... Uh, and his opponent, Jack Rio. I think that's, that's given him that competitive advantage, you know. And we're ready to start the third round. Blood coming out of the nose of Jack Rio. Let's see how these guys come out for the third. Third and final round, folks. Because if you're a judge, you could have it at one round apiece right now. Somebody Definitely. needs to put their signature on this fight. 
Both guys touch glove in the center of the octagon. Jabs exchanged by both guys. Leg kick by Ryo, but Max Fornia is now walking down Jack Ryo. Big shot to the nose from Max Fornia, and Ryo's nose is bleeding. Max walking down Jack and appears to want that big right hand. He's just being patient about it. Nice leg kick thrown by Max Fournier. And Jack Rio answers with one of his own. Big right hand. I thought Jack was going for the takedown there, but. It looked like he was going for it, yeah. He's not, Jack is, has not thrown a single punch in this round here. There oh, there you go, finally. Just under two minutes in uh, the final round here. Beautiful leg kick by Max Fournier. And again, Jack Rio answers with one of his own. Both guys in the center exchanging, exchanging kicks. Beautiful side kick by Max Fournier, and that's got to work the body of Jack Rio once again. Fournier is dictating the pace thus far. Big Solid right hand right. by Max Fournier. I believe Jack is hurt. Big left hook, flurries. Referee stops. Referee stops the Referee fight. stops the bout. Jack Leo's Leo not happy with that stoppage. Happy, it's about the safety of these fighters, right? And, and you got to respect uh, the referee's decision. And there, I got to say, there's blood all over my notes. So here, some, here, here. somebody was bleeding a lot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> lots of blood, lots of hemoglobin up in this place. We got the best seats in the house. We really do have the best seats in the house. But there's not a bad seat in this place. It's a beautiful place to have a fight card. Heroes Combat League, get down here. Ottawa's only amateur MMA event, folks. Sponsored by Preston Hardware and Popeye Supplements. I'm reminded of a Slayer song, Raining Blood. Very impressive fight by Max Fournier. It came out hard, appeared to gas a little bit, and then came out and fought a really smart fight. Great job for Max Fournier. And props to Jack Ryo as well, fought a great fight. Thank <laughs> you.